looking at this boat on the way in. I was like, this is so cute. It reminds me of Forrest Gump. It's like short and stumpy. So cute. I paid 50 cents extra for them too. <laughs> Enjoying that, Kate? You're quick. I don't feel like that was going to happen. I stand on this side. Why didn't I do that earlier? Hi, Kate. dial but that's a good shot this is looking up from Caitlin seat directly up truck bed not even joking it's as tall as me it's eye level it's a sweet uni log What do you reckon, Kate? Isn't that cool? Hmm? Hmm?
Not the market, but I'm a bit late. That is so cute. I was trying to get a drone shot of the pier, but uh, it's a bit weird, so I don't want to test it over water today. I'm going to test it at the next place and then we'll take it from there. Stopping here for a quick coffee break in uh, Charter, Ch Charters. This is their Apple Tree Creek uh, rest stop. And yeah, this is the backup because the, the one that I want to go to in Bundy is a bit of an off road one. So we're not that far from Bundy, I think we're only half an hour out. I'm falling asleep because I had a late night. Yeah. Almost missed it, the Model T car. <laughs> it doesn't even have doors. I can see his, <laughs> his uh, legs hanging out. so neat. This is unique. Uh, I was looking on Google Maps um, next to the campsite and there was just this patch of land. This very straight patch of land. And I was like, what is that? It's really peculiar because obviously nature doesn't build in straight lines. And uh, after a bit of investigation, it's actually the the gliders uh, airstrip. So I think we're actually on the airstrip right now. You can see it's just perfectly flat green field. Oh, I hope I'm not ruining it for them. Maybe I should move off this side. get to be in the shadows. This actually looks like a really cool place to camp. It's quite unique. This one facing east. This 
has got to be one of the most ridiculous spots I've ever camped at. I'm on the side of a airfield. <laughs> Welcome to Matchy's Cooking Show. Today we're making mushroom, olive, and bacon pasta again. I really liked this dish last time, so I'm glad I brought ingredients for two. It also happens to be the, the oldest ingredients I have available right now. These ones are stuffed. Ooh. Some herbs instead. I just realized I threw away the lid. Such a beautiful sunset right now. Wow. The sun's behind some clouds and it's uh, shining with the silver lining. All right, let's get started. Yeah. 